Well, charging documents are revealing new details about a 70-year-old suspect accused of sexually assaulting and robbing young people in West Baltimore. Stefan Dingle is in your corner with the latest on the investigation, and we must warn you, the details are disturbing. On March 8th of this year, Baltimore police revealed a sexual assault and robbery at gunpoint of a student on her way to school near Duclan Street and Gwynn Falls Parkway. The young lady gave investigators the best description she could of the suspect to produce this sketch. Days later, through tips from the community, authorities identified that suspect as 70-year-old Gregory Hightower, who was arrested Tuesday. Charging documents show that Hightower committed another heinous act on January 3rd on the campus of Frederick Douglass High School near North Pulaski Street. During that incident, authorities say a male and female student were approached from behind while sitting and talking on the bench of the school's softball field. Hightower forced both of them to pull down their pants, demanding the girl to perform oral sex on the boy while recording it on his cell phone. Hightower then forced the girl to wear blue latex gloves before performing a sexual act on the suspect himself. This is the same pattern that happened to the most recent victim on her way to school in March. Hightower now faces multiple counts of first, second, and third degree assault and rape, along with charges relating to recording and possessing child pornography, in addition to the possession of a firearm, as well as indecent exposure. On each of those counts combined, Hightower is likely to spend the rest of his life in prison. Right now, he's being held at Baltimore Central Booking as he awaits his first court hearing. In West Baltimore, I'm Stefan Dingle for WJZ. Stefan, thank you. Well, if you have